guys so it's been a bit of a hectic morning for me morning and afternoon i went to bed laid there for hours and then ended up getting up doing things like ordering some bits online for the baby's bedroom at two o'clock in the morning oh just that's this seems to be my life at the moment i just got so much going on in my head and i'm wanting to get stuff done i just can't seem to sleep at a normal time so um yeah i didn't go to bed until about three so i let myself sleep in until 10 so for the last five hours i've been washing my hair tidying cleaning getting more stuff sorted the bedroom is finally not the baby's bedroom but our bedroom is finally cleared cleared and tidy everything like that is pretty much done now i've just been doing that and washing my hair and getting ready and then i remembered that it's the first of june and that i'm vlogging every day this month and i thought oh crap this is the first day of the June vlogs, or Vloon. I don't know what to call it. I don't know whether to call it June or Vloon. I feel like I need to call it something. Otherwise, people may think that I'm either daily vlogging indefinitely, or they won't realise that I'm daily vlogging this month. So that's exciting that that's starting today. But also, not much is happening. And it's the first day of the June vlogs, and nothing is really happening. I've sort of done all my busy bee stuff uh, this morning and this afternoon and now I'm just wrapping up uh, a Depop parcel. So I'm wrapping up this jumper to get sent off to someone that's bought it. My mum is coming round at some point. She said the late afternoon and it's half three so I'm thinking in the next hour or two she'll uh, turn her up but I'm not too sure when she's turning up. I'm undecided whether I'm going to go into town quick and post this package and also get some food bits in town or whether I should just stay put in case she turns up but the weather is awful today it's rainy and cold I don't really want to leave the house especially because I've just washed my hair and I just know as soon as I leave the house and it hits the rain it's going to go which is why I'm fiddling with my hair a lot because I've just washed it so it hasn't really got much texture so it's like really floppy. I don't really know if much is going to happen in this um, in this vlog on day number one which isn't really going to make you guys want to watch the rest of the June vlogs. <laughs> but just bear with me because when my mum comes around I'm not going to vlog and then when she leaves it's going to be the evening. I sort of said to myself that I'll do a whole month worth of vlogging again because I've not done it in a while and um, I really enjoy doing it and having the routine of filming and then editing it first thing in the morning but also this is the last month that we're gonna be baby free the baby's due at the end of july technically this month is the last month that there'll be no baby ever <laughs> but i thought it'd be really fun to actually document sort of the last month well it's not the last month of pregnancy but it's like one of the last months leading up to the birth of our little girl so I thought it would be fun to just vlog as well because it'll be a good way to document all the antenatal classes and appointments we're going to and just kind of what I get up to and prepping the flat and things like that. I don't know. I just thought it would be fun to do a month worth of daily vlogs. So um, I said to myself, I don't have to get a 20 minute vlog up every day. You know, a five minute vlog is fine on some days. So I'm just going to film and see what I get every day and not try and overthink it and worry and get stressed out about it just have fun with it and yeah I'm looking forward to it so I'm going to try and get the vlogs up at about 6 p.m every day quite easy to do now because I have internet that uploads quickly I remember the last time I would have done some daily vlogs I was in my old flat and it would take hours upon hours to upload a video I would have to make sure the vlog was edited by 9 a.m the next day so that it had nine hours to upload to be up by 6 p.m which is really impractical um, and makes daily vlogging quite hard but now i can edit a vlog at three o'clock in the afternoon and i know that it will only take 20 minutes to upload which is fab i'm gonna wrap this depop parcel if you want to check me out on depop it's just the same as all my other usernames it's just rihanna and ashley It's the 1st of June and I am wearing my winter coat. So yeah, this is my, my outfit for today. Uh, it's just a bit chilly. It's only about 14 degrees. Today, I've just bunged on anything um, just because I'm cold. Um, and none of my jumpers fit me anymore, apart from this one, because it's got a slit at the back. 
And I've just put it over another stripy t-shirt. But even my maternity stuff is getting too small for me now. This is the bump today. So as of today, I'm 32 and a half weeks. Scary stuff. Scary, when I say it's scary, I mean like it's exciting scary. So I'm trying to think what I need. Um, this for food, parcel, and wallet. Cool. Oh, June. <laughs> Lovely British summer. <laughs> I can't even have a 15 minute walk into town without needing a wee nowadays. So I'm running to the loo. Scan an item or select an option. because I felt like one and I feel like I've worked really hard today um well I've worked really hard the last few weeks on this flat but I worked really hard today got everything done and now I'm feeling all chilled I was like I'll get myself a coffee on the way home I mean who am I kidding it's not exactly a treat I get coffee all the time but I can try and justify it for today I got a taxi because I've got this huge bag of shopping and if it was a nice day and I wasn't in a rush, I probably would have just walked home just very slowly. Um, but I thought I'd grab a taxi. And he was so rude, I got in. He had both his Apple head headphones in. And he was talking to someone on the phone. He didn't even acknowledge me. Literally the only word he said to me was how much it was when we got outside my flat. <laughs> so I did not tip him. That was just so rude. I was just in the car and he didn't even say hi. I don't really know where my mum is. Like, it's, it's kind of gone past late afternoon now. We're kind of bordering on early evening. I don't know when she's going to be here. But I feel like I should do as much and vlog as much as possible. Because once she gets here I won't be doing much vlogging. But I've kind of done everything that I need to do for today. I feel like my hair has grown so quickly. It probably hasn't. I've probably just got gotten used to it i have got myself a hairdresser's appointment next week or the week after possibly i love having my hair this length um i'll probably i don't know maybe i want to keep it chin level or just below i think any higher and i'm gonna look like a bit of a mushroom because i have quite a small chin so i don't know it might make the top of my head look a bit big when you want to keep your hair at a certain length um when it's short you have to get it cut so often i don't know why i'm telling you guys that you guys really didn't need to know that. I'm going to put this shopping away. I'm getting bored waiting for my mum, so I've just been playing around on Snapchat. <laughs> if you want to follow me, it's just Rihanna and Ashley, like all my other social media. But um, yeah, I'm bored, so I've been playing around on this. So my mum's just been around for the last couple of hours, had some coffee and chats and spoke about baby and I showed her some videos of um, baby's heartbeat and baby moving around and just having a little catch up about many baby stuff really. And how we've said we've got to do a few things before she arrives in seven weeks or eight weeks. They don't let you go two weeks partial due date so we've got a maximum of nine weeks until she's here. I'm now just making Doug and I some dinner so I did a big bowl of salad which is on our plates now over here i just when i do big salads i like to just do it in a big bowl mix it all together and um, have some for the next day it is kind of a greek salad but it's not traditional um, i've put some olive oil and some balsamic um, and some pepper over it and it's got tomatoes onion cucumber uh mixed greens uh, feta and olives and i like to crumble the feta in and mix it in rather than just have chunks of feta and i'm just cooking some pasta i have this sauce to go over the top 
so we had dinner and watched a film and just chilled for the last couple of hours i'm now just cleaning up the kitchen and then we're gonna go to bed i wish i'd remembered it was the first of june today and i would have vlogged a little bit earlier on instead of starting the vlog at three o'clock this afternoon although i really was just washing my hair and cleaning the house well the flat but yes this is the start of vlogging every day in june and oh 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 let me show you the bedroom so the bedroom is finally cleared it had to say it's been such a mess since we moved in here and i have finally organized everything look at this floor space it's all tidy my little beauty station doesn't have a load of junk on anymore everything is just clean and tidy i think it'll be quite nice to get some I don't know a plant in here or something it's looking quite bare and we have well we have our new blinds over there we just have a slight problem they are like that much too big to fit in the windowsill <laughs> so yeah we're gonna have to figure something out there and we've got the baby i keep gonna go say her name and it, still no one has guessed her name in the last vlog um i've had quite a lot of comments with you guys trying to guess her name and nope her name is still not being guessed yet i don't think i don't think anyone's gonna guess it do you think someone's gonna guess it <laughs> tug's like shrugging his shoulders i'm like that doesn't really work in a, in a video you need to talk yeah but we have our her crib here already i mean it's still got um the mattress and the packaging and everything like that and um, but yeah the cot the crib the crib <laughs> not the cot the crib is here already for her she needs to stay in there for a little bit longer and carry on carry on cooking don't want her coming just yet as much as i'm excited to meet her um, i'd much rather her stay in my tummy and and get all big and strong i'm just gonna finish tidying up and get my makeup off and all of that jazz so i will see you guys tomorrow